Hello and welcome back. So here is the final evolution of the Deep Sea Benil Deep Sea Fathom series. So let's go ahead and enjoy this animation right here. And then we're going to go ahead and see how Deep Sea Fathom does in battle and check out Deep Sea Fathom's animations. That is awesome. I love how the tail is bioluminescent. Let's go ahead and come on down here and see, <coughs> pardon me, this cough, this cough, how this goes. All right, so look at how gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous um, Deep Sea Fathom is. A nice hit there. And let's go ahead and just take a bite right here. Awesome. And we'll go ahead and see if this will finish you off. Not quite. Okay, so here is Deep Sea Fathom. And let's go ahead and take a look at this is Bubble Storm, which has a poor chance of hitting. This is Clobber, which is an excellent chance of hitting. Here we have Aqua Burst, which is good, and then this is Flood, which is just okay, and that's as a recharge of one. So Aqua Burst also has a recharge of one, as, as does Clobber. Let's go ahead and start out with Clobber and see what Clobber does right over here. I love, I love the bioluminescent tail. That is so cool. <laughs> Goodbye, Fathom. All right, so consider the following graph, points 0, 10, and 9, 7, uh, which has a greater rate of change, 0 to 10, and 9, 7 would be a greater rate of change, <laughs> which means that the slope is more dramatic. All right, let's go ahead and take a bite out of you. There we go. One more good hit should do it for us. Here we have uh, zero, 06. I can actually go ahead and just put little dots on it. Zero, we do X, X first. Zero, 06 to 10, 3.5. 10, 3.5. That would be like this. So the red line, the line on the graph, is going to have a greater rate of change. It has a slope. That would be more fun to roll down. All right, let's go ahead and send some uh, green gusts over here and see if we can finish up this battle. And then we will go ahead and read about our deep sea fathom friend. Look at that, just so gorgeous. So, so amazingly gorgeous, wow. Let me know in the comments what you think about deep sea fathom. Just absolutely amazing. Okay, All right, let's go ahead and come on over here. Take a peek in there, hey Adrian and got some florins which is awesome so let's take a look over here open up the pet book go to our last page and then take a look here is deep sea fathom this rare fathom lives in the deepest parts of the sea in total darkness using the lamp on its head to light the way and find sunken ships to feast on I love how it has a star over here for it. And if we look at the evolutions, you can see how the light changes from one, gets a little bit longer, and then it fully extends here as we reach Fathom. And the same thing happens with the uh, tail and all of the fins as well. They just get more and more and then grow and develop. Just absolutely awesome, awesome design. I really, really love it. We start off with two dots here too, and then we have four, and then it's just all over the place. Dot insanity. Just super, super artistic. I love how beautiful these are. The animations are really cool as well. So uh, let me know in the comments what you think though, but this was so fun getting Deep Sea Fathom. I hope you enjoyed these videos as well, um, and uh, we will be back here tomorrow. Tomorrow, something exciting happened to me today that uh, there will be a video well, two, two super exciting things happened today that there will be videos coming out for uh, tomorrow so take care keep on prodiging on uh, thanks for all of the likes thanks for all of the subscribes and all of your awesome comments we will be seeing you tomorrow uh, have a good one bye bye